I am Chris Edwards and welcome to this week's Tennis Warehouse vlog. We have the new speeds from Head to look at this week. They are now available for pre-sale and will be in stock ready to ship on March 3rd. So uh, we've been hitting these a bunch, especially the Pro and the Mid Plus and check our YouTube channel for the reviews on those for more information. First up, I've got the Pro in my hands and I've actually switched to this rack. I'm really in love with the playability of this new 2022 Head Speed Pro, silky smooth feel to it, ton of control, love that 18, 20 string bed. Um, feel like I can just put my backhand slice on a dime with this racket and um, and then just getting a ton of control at net, really placing my volleys exceptionally well. And it's got the mass for me to uh, still drive through the ball and add some pace to my shots too. And uh, I have more of a traditional style swing and so I just find that dense string bed and a little bit of extra weight comes through the ball perfectly for me and just gets me really dialed in. If I'm gonna hit a target, it's probably gonna be with this racket. Really, really enjoying the playability on this one. So let's have a quick look at the specs. They're really close actually to the outgoing model. Um, the biggest change really is the addition of the oxetic material in this racket and it just gives it such a sweet feel. Feels super connected to the ball, really dialed in to my targets as I mentioned earlier. So really enjoying the update of uh, every head racket I've hit with oxetic in it has just played great. They're putting, pumping out dynamite rackets across their lines right now are head. So over here we've got 11.5 ounces, um, six points headlight, a 326 swing weight and a 62 RA. So right in line with the outgoing model, that plush plush feel from that 62 RA, tons of control from the dense string bed, loving that one. And as I said earlier, uh, I've made the switch and that's my new racket of choice. Okay, next up we've got the MP. And if I had a more aggressive uh, modern style of play and I was taking those big sharp angled cuts of the ball and hitting with a lot more top spin and had a younger lively arm and I was just carrying more tip, tip speed this would definitely be my choice if I was just playing a ton of doubles mostly I was looking to really mix it up and get a lot of angles I love the spin capability of this speed MP and again with the oxetic material I think it just feels uh, sweet as a nut as I would say and our play tester Andrew out in Atlanta he's making the switch to this one he's in love with this racket um, as well. And uh, this one, uh, the specs, 11.1 ounces, four points headlight, so a little bit closer to even balance than you get with the Pro. And that keeps that swing weight at a 323. So you still got some mass behind the ball to help you put it away. But at 11.1 ounces, super light and easy to get around still. So you get that easy acceleration to hit the spin. And again, 62 RA, so silky smooth feel. Love the response of that one. Now we've got the team. So if you're looking for um, something a little lighter and faster, more of a uh, you know top level beginner, becoming an intermediate sort of regular club level player, or you're right there playing league tennis at your club, um, and you're looking for a control oriented racket that's still easy to get around, accelerate through the ball, you can add some spin quite easily with it. I think this is a great way to go. Um, this one's 10.5 ounces, so nice and whippy. There are two points headlights, so you're getting pretty close to an even balance. Uh, 306 swing weight, so it's very, very light. Again, and fast to easy get around. And it's got a little bit of a firmer beam, and that's to help you get some pop on the ball. So 66 RA on this one, and uh, that's gonna replace the weight that you're missing. So you get power from the weight and the other ones, and this one, you've just got a slightly firmer beam, and that's gonna help you uh, put a bit more juice on the ball. And then a great option for the player looking for something super fast and maneuverable, or maybe a junior looking for their first adult size racket, smaller framed adult, or anyone just really looking to carry a lot of tip speed. This Team L is a great way to go. And this one drops that strong weight down to 9.7 ounces on average. Uh, one point head heavy on this one. So again, very close to even balance. Um, and that's gonna keep the swing weight just over 300, about a 302 we found on average. And again, 66 RA on that one. So it's got a little bit more in the beam to help you out where it doesn't have the mass to get behind the ball. So great option again, if you're looking for something super fast and easy to swing, but all of these rackets loaded with control, great feeling rackets, ton of precision for the player that really wants to feel dialed in to their targets. Okay, let's have a look at some strings now. And I've got um, Head's new Lynx Touch string in one of the prior, uh, the prior generation of the Speed Pro here. And this is the racket I was testing it in when we reviewed this. So be sure to check our YouTube channel for the review on Lynx Touch. And this is a really interesting string. It's got two different materials that are working together to really offer a very plush and soft and comfortable feel for a co-poly string. Still not gonna get that um, plushness of like a multi-filament or a natural gut, but if you're a poly player, you want the spin and control of a poly, 
you're going to get it here and you get a much more ball pocketing and a nice plush response right there from that one. So that's Lynx Tour. You can get that in 16, 17 sets and reels. And then last but not least, we've got uh, Polytour Strike. We've um, talked about this in the black and the gray colorway. Those play pretty crisp. Now it's available in the blue. This is uh, Naomi Osaka's string of choice. Blue looks super good in the racket too, and it's going to offer you a slightly softer feel than you'll get from the, from the black and the gray pigments and polys, which tend to make them play a little deader, a little firmer. Um, so this one, you're going to get a little bit more pocking, a little bit more life out of the string bed on this one, but still tons of control, great access to spin there from Poly Tour Strike, a nice firm, crisp feel out of that string. And that's all I've got for this week. Thank you so much for watching.